you could sit with anyone, for any five people, alive or dead, who would you sit with? Well, obviously, first my dad. That's the first one. I feel like I understand people and their motivations quite well. So, so you, so you'd not be interested. It's not that I wouldn't be interested. So I understand them. I know what Genghis Khan would say. I feel like I know what Malcolm X would say. That'd be somebody I don't understand. Maybe the ruler of Dubai. The ruler of Dubai would be amazing, 100 percent, because he has such vision. So that's two. Churchill. Winston <laughs> Churchill. Yeah, I, under him. I understand him, but just out of respect, got him on the OGs list. That's interesting. Who He's else? a bit controversial, I guess. Yeah, I mean, but I under I already understand him. But you'll I'd have like some. You'll have him. a cigar with him. Yeah, oh, he's sure. For the pipe. Nelson, Admiral Nelson, the British fleet. I don't maybe know. even Napoleon. Maybe even Napoleon. I'd like to talk to. I'd like to talk to King Henry VIII. <laughs> the guy who killed the eight uh, who beheaded. I don't understand how why he got rid of so many wives. I'd like to just say, bro. <laughs> Relax. Yeah, chill. <laughs> There's other ways. Just block them on Instagram. <laughs> Talk to him. Yeah, I'm not sure. It's difficult. Yeah, but that's interesting. Who's this admiral guy? Nelson was one of the most famous. They have Nelson's column in London. It's one of the most famous admirals in British naval history. And uh, he died at war. I think he lost an eye. He famously said, good thing God gave me two. Well, when he that. got shot, he got asked, I think his arm was ripped off, and he asked to be put in a bathtub and continued to give orders until he passed out and died. From the bathtub? Yeah, he retired. I like him because he retired. I think it was him who actually beat Napoleon. No, Duke, it was Arthur Wellesley that beat Napoleon at Waterloo, but I, I think it was Nelson that sunk the French Armada. He sunk the French, or the Spanish Armada. I'm getting confused. He sunk the, sunk the Spanish Armada, and he retired after he beat everybody. And then he was cripplingly depressed in his retirement. Because he could not be out of work. Yeah, and then something else came up and they said, you're the only guy who can do it, but you're probably going to die. And he said, good, I want to die. 